Hi guys, welcome back to a brand new TikTok amazing fair reaction <gasps> video. Hello everyone, what is the tea? What is the scalding hot Darjeeling? Hopefully you're all doing wonderful. Uh, yes, hi. So I know this one is a little bit earlier than normal. I'm actually going to be doing two uh, for December. I'm just doing this a couple days early because I've been sent so many things over on TikTok that if I didn't do another one of these videos now, I was going to end up losing a lot of stuff. So there's going to be two as you get two this time, girls. But as always, guys, make sure you do hit the like button, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos that do come up. I do videos twice a week around a multiple variety of topics. But anyway, <gasps> let's not be around the bush and get straight on to these... TikToks. So what is? Oh, good. Oh, what's happening? Wait, what? Why is there a dog? Wait, what just happened? Wait, what? 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 What the hell just happened? This person like pulled the 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 Medusa piercing like away. Can you pick up the jewelry? Oh, they dropped the jewelry. Can you pick up the? No, you just dropped a jewelry. What are you doing? Pick it up. Oh, okay. Just hold it. I hold it? Yeah, just hold it right there. Alright. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. This is awful. Why is that person just carrying a dog around the background as well? Like that. Get the dog. But what? What kind of studio is this? This is really bad. This is really bad. Can you ever imagine going into a piercing studio and getting like the person's like mum to hold the clamp for you because? Get the dog away from the pit. This is so wrong. If I have to explain to you why this is wrong, there is a problem. I'm gonna have to mute some of the audio because there is music playing in the background, so I'll put bits in if I think it's like important. But she's basically just saying it's really hurting. Please, can you carry? Like, can you hurry up? It's really hurting. Never going back there again. I am not surprised. And she eventually gets it in. Oh my god. We're starting off strong, girls. Oh. This is gonna faint. Bye, girls. I'm gonna head out. I don't really even have words to describe what just happened. I'm going to just show you the very beginning bit again because we, we obviously I was a bit confused what was going on. If you see, so I, he drops the jewellery that he was going to put in, but he like pulls on her top lip where her Medusa is, where she's getting the piercing. But look, he yanks on the piercing. Like, look. That was so unbelievably terrible. First of all, I am so sorry to you that that happened to you. That is, uh, that's so totally unacceptable. Like, I've seen many bad, like, bad, like, unprofessional piercers doing things before, but this is really bad. Why is there a person just carrying a dog as well around in the background? What is this place? Like, what? I've never seen anything like that before, ever, ever. That's so unprofessional. Like, what? And then she was like, can you pick up the jewelry? Can you get, like, you can't then use the same jewelry you just dropped on the floor. Like, what are you doing? That was shocking, girls. Mm, so what's this? I'm gonna this? record while I pierce my own nose. Okay, so I know what I'm doing. I have my piercing. I have the friggin' needle. I don't know if it's big enough. Watch me pierce my nose. I know what I'm doing. I have a needle. Just showing a, a literally just a blunt earring. Choo choo! I'm gonna go fast because I'm too scared to do it. Like, it's already red because I've been trying to do it. Well, you've obviously not been going fast then, have you? I'm gonna just make the video faster. So, yeah. Why? I just don't. I would never understand why people think it's a good idea to literally force a oh, no, blunt no, no. object through their skin. Oh, no, oh, no. Like, I just don't understand. Like, I, do, I, would, I don't get it. I don't think it's gonna come out, dude. And again, this this is someone who clearly has Fuck to like no. this is America, whatever. And they're gonna have to pay for all their healthcare. Gonna have to pay for like, do you know what? I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna bother like, watching the rest of that video. Like, it's just stupid. Like, there's nothing there's uh, there's nothing I love more than when someone goes, "Hi, I know what I'm doing," and then just proceeds to do everything wrong. No girls, trot along, bitch. It just ain't okay, girl. What's gonna happen is people are gonna see that and go, oh, she knows what she's doing. She's got an earring and just kind of pushing it through. So I should be able to do it too. Ah, uh, like, 
I hate this idea. I just, I don't understand how anyone, how anyone can honestly say that people won't copy or people won't be influenced or people won't like, it's just, you are just, you are li you are willingly being blind to the facts in the, in this. Like if you are honestly going to sit there and say, no one will ever copy, no one will ever, like you are just being, you are just willingly being blind. You're willingly being blind to the facts. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, ew, 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 ew. how did that, oh, oh, oh. Am I just trying to take these pieces out? No. Oh, no. How did that happen? Oh, that's gross. Oh, ew, 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 ew. How did you do that? How did it get caught in the bottle rim? Oh, no. Oh, you poor thing. Oh, my computer's like, hello, girls. How did your lip piercing get, like, caught in the in the bottle like that? Oh, no. Imagine doing it. It's like drinking. Same. Like, hello, girls. I'm having a little sip of my water. Sippy weepy. Ugh, dead. Ugh, dead. Good heavens. I, it's awful. That was really bad. I don't know how that happened. It's like sometimes when I drink out of a can, the little uh, loop, I don't tend to drink out cans very often, but the little loop here, I'll sometimes be doing that. And then it gets caught on my septum piercing that like the loop bit will get caught in it. That's not fun. Don't put it, okay? Oh my God. What is that sound? I have never, in a shopping center. Are you kidding? I have never in my life. I have never seen someone in my life try to get a piercing done. <laughs> Like this in a shopping center. I've seen like little piercing okay. boosts of like piercing guns, but never like this. Yeah. Why are you pushing down on the. This is so bad. This is so bad. This. This person clearly has no idea what they're doing. This is so bad. Oh, and it just stops. Oh, I wanted to see the finished product. I've seen people get like, the ghost of little piercing booths and like have like a piercing gun done, whatever. And yes, it's awful, but I have, you know, it's very common. I see that quite a lot, but like to do actual real modification, like a tongue piercing in this unsanitary environment, just with everyone around you. What? How was that legal? Like, I don't understand how that's actually legal. Like, I'm really confused how that is legal. I need someone to tell me. I just think is I don't know where that is. I'm guessing America. I could not imagine that ever happening in the UK. And then she, when she put the jewelry on, she just put it on top of the, the like, the tube. Obviously, because, like, the plasticky stuff. So, it, like, it's pushed it down. And because it's not metal, because it's not an actual needle, it, like, jolted to the side. Like... Make it make sense. Wrong way around. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. But please comment something down below. Have you ever seen someone get a tongue piercing or like a real, like a real modification more than just like a, you know, an ear, earlobe gun, whatever, but like in a shopping center like that? I've never known it anywhere or anything. I've literally never seen this happen before. Sippy wee on the root beery weary ah. So what is all oh, this music? Out Wait, what? How old is this person? This person's getting a, a, a tongue piercing and, and, oh my God, are they getting a snake eye? Are they getting a snake? Are you kidding me? How old is this person? If I have anyone who like appears to be like under the age of 16, I actually, I tend to blur their face. Now, I don't know how old this person is. This person could just look very young, but I'm going to try to blur their face, at least on the top half. This person looks like 12. This person looks so young, like so young. Oh my God. There's music in the background, by the way. I, this per, I can't even believe this is happening. Like snake eye piercings in general anyway are just awful. But like the fact that this person looks, I, even if this person just looks a bit younger than they are, they can't be, they can't, they would, there's no way that they're like over 18. If this is someone who just happens to look a bit young, they're definitely no more than 16 at maximum. But this person looks like 12, like genuinely looks like 12. I get that people can look younger than what they actually are. I understand that. But this person looks underage. And all the comments are saying this person's 12. This person's way too young. What is this person doing? Like, why are you doing it on a child? That, 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 I, I'm very conflicted and we're well, not conflicted. I know how to feel, but I'm just more confused. Like, That, I hope that was just someone who just looked young. 
I've I can't. I'm not even, I can't even comment. I'm sorry, guys. I'm I'm actually quite speechless. I'm actually quite, I don't normally get speechless, but I'm I can't. So what I is this? I just got this new piercing. Wait, what? It's, uh, what? Part of a headphone cord. No, 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 not no, I'm not doing that. Not doing that. Absolutely not. No, we're not doing that. No, we're not doing that. No, 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 no. No, 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 Oh my gosh. Oh, ew. How have you let it get that? Oh no. So I'm gonna have to blur the, the top half of the date because, okay, that was a very quick video. I'm gonna have to blur the top half of the date because the date was like really scabby and disgusting and like blood was everywhere. I don't understand how you've let your ears get this bad. Again, like I don't get it. Like I know I say this all the time, but like I don't get how, like wh at what point were you gonna go, do you know what? Maybe I should get something done about this because it's so disgusting. Again, like I always say, like this isn't just like oh, I woke up in the morning and it was crusty. This is like I've never cleaned my piercings. Like I don't look after my piercings at all. It's just a mess like if you're going to get them you have to be dedicated you can't just be like oh it doesn't matter sound doesn't leave it but it no no it's literally a wound in your body gales like you need you need you need to clean them clean 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 your piercings rinse them with saline okay so what is this gale so what's happening the sound oh it's just music so we're zooming into the ew you see it pop out ew Oh gosh, I mean, obviously just obviously just has a ball that's far too small. But like, can we just, wait, 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 wait. First of all, poke it, that's disgusting, poke it out, ew, gross. But can we just say, what's this on her septum piercing? Is that like a bogey that's like stuck to the septum? It's like, there's it's like a little bump. Is that bogey? Don't bogey up your nose, girl. Having septum piercings in the winter is so annoying. Like if you have ever, ever have like a runny nose, cause you know when it's like really cold, it does tend to make your nose run sometimes. Like, or if you just have a cold or flu or whatever, like it's having a septum piercing is so awful. Piercing my friends at school. There's a friend's nose at school. Got the needle through, oh, for God's sake. Now the piercing. I forgot. To say. Why? Again, it's a septum piercing. Why is it always septum piercings? We lost the ball, but put another. We lost. Do you see them? They're just crawling around the floor looking for a ball that they've just dropped and they're gonna. Again, though, what is it with septum piercings? Why is it sept Why is it always septum piercings that people love to do themselves? I don't understand. Like, I don't understand. I, d I need someone to tell me this because I don't understand. I'm coming out. I want the world to know. I've got gout. Right. What is? Okay, yeah. Oh One, my two, god. Three. Oh, are you I kidding me? Oh, oh no. So you couldn't see what the text said because I had to blur. Obviously, I, I, I will blur them out. Um, it says my eight week old baby and she's getting two earrings with piercing guns. Children are not toys. They're not accessories. They're not purses that you can add a, a lucky charm to. They're not a bracelet. You can add a charm, like a charm to your charm bracelet. Oh, I can't. I, I don't. I just will never understand. I don't care where you're from, what's normal, where you are. Piercing a baby's ears is just not okay, especially when you're doing it with piercing guns. Like, I don't understand. Like, I do not understand. Why? Your baby does not need ear piercings. Your eight-week-old baby does not need ear piercings. All this, oh, well, they won't remember. It doesn't matter what you what you can or can't remember. You're still causing pain and stress. Can you imagine saying to anyone, well, they won't remember it. It doesn't matter. Imagine, imagine going to someone who's got Alzheimer's and go, well, I might I might take some of their money or steal because, you know, they don't have a memory. So they, might, they won't remember that they had the money here. So what does it matter? Like, it's such a stupid argument. It's so stupid. Oh, well, there's a song. So let me go, do a vertical called the Brett Girls. Oh, we love a pierced Gengar moment. I want a Gengar plushie with piercings. That would be fun. Oh. Right through the gums, girl. <laughs> Wonderful, stylish. We love, we love, we love a pierced Gengar. Oh, it's always nice to have a fun one in between all the devastation. So what is this? Oh, it's music. Day one, I got it pierced. So why? Get, get your fingers away from it. Get your fingers away from the piercing. What are you doing second day? So you're touching your hair. And then you're touching your piercing. Great. Wonderful. And like, why is it swollen? I don't know why it's swollen. Day, girl, what the F? The bar wasn't long enough. It's because you're going, oh, no, no, I don't know why my piercing isn't healing. I can't. I'm not even going to watch the rest of that video. You're like, ah, my, the bar's not long enough. I'm, my, my, I'm too swollen. But you're literally doing this. I mean, maybe the bar was too short or whatever, but you're, you're still doing this. Like, I don't know if people think that they, they're just immune to 
any infection or like immune to, you know, swelling or immune to anything. Like I am not exempt from any rule. If I decide when I get a new piercing, I'm, you know, I'm a bit lazy one day and go to bed without cleaning it. It will, I will have an adverse reaction or an effect the next day. Like even me with all of this, I still have to follow the rules. Thing as well, this is the kind of thing that my piercer talked about. How like sometimes though people will come back to the store and be like, you did it wrong. It wasn't right. It was your fault. And then they'll like, Ronnie has asked them like, well, how many times have you been cleaning? And they're like, I'm not. Unhinged girls. So what is this? Ew, what's happening? Now finish, now finish what? Finish him. What's happening? Ew. No, thank you. Next. So what is, oh. I need to turn the music off. No. Oh, no. Oh, ew. Oh, it's so what? Oh, what is that? That's whatever the hell that is, is hideous. What is this doll thing? This Ew, ew, I hate it. Even I like, obviously I'm not screaming because the piercings themselves, but just the thing, just that doll thing is so gross. Ew. Oh, I'm gonna have nightmares tonight, girls. So what is this? Oh, they are go stunning. I'm going to Claire's for a lobotomy. Wait, what? Wait. I'm so excited to go get my new piercing. I'm going to Claire's for a lobotomy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? Hello, I'm here for my appointment, girl. Okay, sit down in the chair. <laughs> Again, it's nice to have something fun to break up the disgusting, ever discro, dis, 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 bleh. We love an infected ear. Oh, we love infected ears. Oh, ew, ew, ew. Oh, God. Passy, wassy. Time to bleed. Disgusting. Vile. I wonder what happened. I wonder what happened to this person to have their ear like that. I think I can show this. I don't think this is too much. I think that's fine. Whatever happened. Tell me what happened. Well, guys, as always, I'm well and truly aboard the trigger train. Choo -choo, speeding down the way where I'm about to crash off and plunge to my death. Babish. Oh my god, are my fans breaking? Oh my gosh, this has been a lot. Thank you so much for everyone who just sent me things uh, to react to. You guys are wonderful. As always, please hit the like button, subscribe, because it really does help me out. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos that are coming up. I'm, I st I'm still shooketh over, well, many things. I'm still shooketh over the baby who's eight weeks old getting double piercing gun earrings. Absolutely terrible. The girls who were piercing their friend in the bathroom and they were like crawling along the floor trying to find a pierce, like the ball that fell down. Disgusting. That pierce at the, uh, near the beginning who was like yanked on the girl's lip. Like, disgusting. That, oh, that awful goblin jelly baby doll thing. Disgusting. <laughs> oh my gosh. So just a little fun uh, response I do have for a lot of people who've been asking me. Yes, yes, yes. I will be doing an end of year review of like worst piercings of the year that I've seen. I'm probably going to do it maybe next week. So a little and out, you know, be out a little bit before the end of the year. So there will be like a, a year in review of piercing fails because last year's one did really well and you like really loved it. So yes, I will be doing an end of year piercing video. But, oh my gosh, this has been a lot. Happy December. It's almost December. Uh, I know this is a tiny bit early, but happy December. I hope you're all having a wonderful time. Um, and I hope the holidays is all fabulous and wonderful for you. I know this time of year gets very busy. So a lot of you come in and out of the videos and don't necessarily watch everything. So I do hope you have a wonderful holiday season. Happy holidays to everyone. I'm sending you lots of love. Thank you for making this year so special for me. It's been very, it's been a lot. Um, but, you know, time goes on. Anyway... Sending lots of love. A massive shout out to my lovely patrons whose names you can see on the side of the screen here. Thank you for being my wonderful patrons. You guys are wonderful. And an extra special shout out to my top tier Patreons. Alexander Shaw, Aurora666, Benjamin Baker, Bethard, BoosterShot93, Renna, Cassie H, Kaz.Thom, Shell Herman, Chris Williams, Karen Pemberton, Crafty Leaks, Dark Angel666, Dan Anita, Heather Prissy, IEA, Kat L, Kelly Bowser, Chloe Louise, Laura Ali, Robin Scott, Sam Perfect, Savannah Truton, Sierra on a bunny, Sefutech, and Sus Mac. Thank you for being my top two patrons. You guys are wonderful. I love you. There's a link down below if you'd like to come Patreon too and get some fun little rewards, Gail. Anyway, be fabulous, be amazing, be gay, be everything you want to be, and don't let any bitch of the day that you can't be you. Why is that? Because you are flawless.